What's up, gamers? It's me, Mass YouTuber. Now, um, so today you saw the Nintendo Direct, and I want to show you my favorites, not the top five actually this time. I want to show you my top ten. I'm I decided to change it for um, and we're gonna just count on my favorite announcements that were seen and stuff. So let's start off with number ten. Number ten was Skyward Sword HD. It was part of the predictions video and. Boy, is it really a good time to finally see Skyward Sword HD. And um, I might not do any clips because I think it's a better idea if I don't show the clips because I might get a copyright um, strike or something like that. So I'm just going to show you a picture of some sort. And uh, yeah, Skyward Sword HD. Wow, that's a surprising Um announcement it's a great prediction i just like the prediction number nine by the way i didn't mean to say prediction i meant to say um the the, the the announcement i like the announcement but number nine is star wars hunters now you might know star wars a lot and i just was surprised to see that star wars hunters is coming soon in star wars Wow, like like Star Wars, like fighting game, it's really a good idea to blend in the idea of Star Wars into like like fighting, I guess. Tactics or something like that. I don't know. But it's a really good announcement and it just surprises me sometimes. Number eight, by the way, I'm just gonna read all of this on the thing just to let you know. Number eight is Age of Calamity expansion pass dlc now the dlc of this um um of hyrule warriors is basically just you know incredible like z like um age of calamity like wow like age of calamity not that it's not my favorite game it's just that i'm i want to see what the game is and i'm actually pretty excited about the dlc i hope I want to see what's coming in store later. Number seven is Splatoon 3. Splatoon 3. Now, Splatoon 3, I was, it's actually a surprising uh, announcement for me. It was the final announcement in the Nintendo Direct. It was so surprising that I just got so, you know, surprised. And it just really surprised me. And basically, Splatoon 3 is like, it has new game modes and stuff probably and yeah and it comes next year so you're gonna have to wait i'm sorry about that number six is metopia on switch now i've been wanting to play metopia but um I, you need the 3ds for it but since the game's coming out on switch i'm actually excited and the newest feature is horses now metopia came out i think back in like um in japan in 2016 and 2017 for north america and I didn't want, I couldn't play it because you have to get the 3DS. But it's coming out on Switch finally, so I am super excited for that. I think it comes like during summer or something like that. Or May, but probably. So yeah, I am excited for that to come out. Number five is the Animal Crossing Super Mario DLC. Now, I was going to say the Ducey Super Girl, um, Superhero um, Girls um, game coming to switch soon but i'm keeping it as an honorable mention so i decided to change it with animal crossing now i love mario as you all know and uh, i really wanted to play animal crossing new horizons i don't have the game but i'm just excited to find out that mario and animal crossing are crossovering for the 35th anniversary of super mario which ends next month on march 31st so um stay tuned for um that I'm, I'm when the game like when the event um ends i'm gonna have my um favorite things that happened during the march um the, the event i don't know we'll see about that but animal crossing yeah i'm happy number four is plans for zombies battle for neighborville completed edition coming to switch now, I'm not really a big fan of plants or zombies. I like Angry Birds a lot more because, you know, it's slinging. 
But for Plants vs. Zombies, I actually do want to experience more about um, Plants vs. Zombies. I may do a quick play on Plants vs. Zombies 1, 2, Heroes, or 3 maybe. But and for um, Battle for Naperville, I want to experience it and actually might get it soon. I don't know. We'll see. But it's a good announcement and I just like it. Number 3 is Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and the character that we're gonna get is, okay, it's a Xenoblade Chronicles um, character, um, whatever the character is, it's popping up on the screen right now, and, um, I like the character, I forgot her, the, her name, I'm sorry about that, but when I saw it at the beginning of the direct, um, I saw, um, Xenoblade, um, Chronicles, and I was like, I was kind of confused, until I realized that it's Switch, and I didn't know which character until I found out it's, um, she, it's a she, and, yo, I'm, I'm excited for the character, I'm excited. I don't really know Zenith Chronicles since the game is teen, once I do th turn 13, I'm gonna start playing the Zenith Chronicles games that are on the Switch. So, yeah, I'm excited for that character. Number two is Fall Guys on Switch. Now, I want to just say before we talk about Fall Guys, I'm sorry about um, Breath of the Wild 2 sequel. I was hoping there would be more news, but nope, there's not. But at least Fall Guys is there. Fall Guys and, of course, Skyward Sword. But it's not going to be on here, of course. But, um... Fall Guys. Maybe it might be, but whatever. Anyway, <clears throat> Fall Guys. And I really wanted Fall Guys, but it was on the PS4 and the Xbox One, probably. So I really wanted it on Switch, and it's now finally coming. Oh, yeah. And I'm excited. It comes in summer, but don't you worry. We can still wait. <laughs> but whatever. Fall Guys, I'm excited. I am excited for that game to come out. And I just look, hope I'm looking forward to that game. Number one, drum roll please. <laughs> Mario Golf Super Rush. Now I know you're wondering, why Mario Golf? Well, um, I am interested in playing Mario Golf. And plus, it was one of my suggestions um, on my predictions video um, yesterday. And I'm just happy that Mario Golf is actually a real game on Switch. So, I'm so glad that Mario Golf is finally back. I'm just so happy that it's finally returning to the big screen. Oh, yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you liked my favorite things that I enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.